Today I wanna to share with you five reasons why you should buy a Subaru. Or if you already own a Subaru, these are gonna be five examples or five things that maybe you didn't know that make Subaru such a great car to own and will make you happy knowing you already have a Subaru. We're also gonna be talking about pricing. This is the beginning of 2024, February 2024 to be exact. We're gonna use this 24 Crosstrek as an example that currently has a window sticker MSRP of 31,122. Just a little teaser, there's a good chance you can get it much lower than that. I'm gonna talk about that in further details towards the end of this video. And if you guys are new to my channel, my name is Alex. I like to share weekly videos just like this one, sharing tips and tricks all about Subaru related topics. So if you think you might enjoy those kinds of videos, consider clicking that subscribe button down below. As always, if you guys have any questions, leave those down below and I'll do my best to answer them for you. The first benefit and huge advantage with buying a Subaru is that you can buy almost any one of these and know that it's going to have a standard symmetrical all-wheel drive. The reason why I say almost any one of them is because the BRZ, our two-door rear-wheel drive Subaru is the exception. That's kind of an anomaly in the Subaru land, but all of our Subarus, the Legacy four-door sedan, the Impreza, the smaller hatchback, the Crosstrek, the crossover SUV, our midsize Forester. I don't have an Outback over here right now, but even our larger Ascent is going to have standard symmetrical all-wheel drive. So the benefit to that, it doesn't matter if you go with our lowest price base trim or you go with the higher trim touring line, you're gonna have that same standard symmetrical all-wheel drive system, which means if you're driving through mountains, through snow, through rain, gravel roads, dirt roads, you name it, you're gonna have the confidence knowing you're gonna be able to make it through in your car. And you don't have to pay extra to get it. The second benefit to buying a Subaru is that they are among one of the safest cars on the road today in 2024. Just as an example, if you look at independent agencies like the Insurance Institute of Highway Safety, that's a mouthful, or IIHS, you'll see that Subaru was awarded top safety pick for seven of their 2024 models. And not only that, but since 2013, Subaru has received a cumulative 70 top safety pick awards, which is more than any other brand. So what makes Subaru so special in regards to safety? Why did they set themselves apart from other cars in their class? Well, one of the reasons why they are ranked among one of the safest cars is due to their camera technology, the EyeSight camera system, which has been out, by the way, since 2013. It only became standard on all the models and trim levels in, I believe, 2020. So it's only been three or four years that they've had this standard safety equipment. No matter if you go at the base trim level or the highest trim level, you're going to have those EyeSight cameras. Now, if you're unfamiliar with what those do, those detect objects out ahead. So if you are in a situation where somebody pulls out in front of you suddenly and you don't have quite enough time to react, the car is going to try to do that for you. It's gonna use the emergency automatic braking system to slow down the car to hopefully avoid an accident or at least decreases damages that could have been done. You also have the benefit of using your adaptive cruise control. So inside here, if you set your cruise control and the car out ahead, is going slower than the speed that you set with your cruise control, your car will adapt to that speed and slow down and pace behind them until they get out of the way. So some nice convenience and safety features with that EyeSight technology. And Subaru doesn't just stop there with their safety technology. So we have the EyeSight cameras that help with accident and avoidance, but you also want a very stable and structurally sound vehicle. One way they make the car stable is with how the engine is positioned in the bay. So this is the horizontally opposed boxer four cylinder engine you may have heard of before. That has some advantages. It sits really low in the engine bay, which helps create a lower center of gravity. So when you are taking turns, the car stays very stable. If you do have a side impact collision, you have less chance of rollover because of how the weight is distributed. And then on the inside, you may notice on the back door of Subaru, and this has been around for a, quite a long time, there's a little hook here and there's a latch right there that hooks into place when you close the door. So this helps create more structural integrity. That little hook is a steel beam that goes up into the side of the door and connects to the frame of the car, keeping it structurally sound if there is a side impact collision or you get hit in the rear 
of the car. So if you look at those crash test rating videos, you'll notice that Subarus almost always stay intact. So you have the crumple zone up front and the crumple zone in the rear, but where passengers sit on the inside almost always stays intact because of how the car is engineered. The third reason to buy a Subaru is because no matter your lifestyle, these are very capable cars. As an example, our Subaru SUVs come standard with at least 8.7 inches of ground clearance. So it doesn't matter if you go with the smaller crossover like our Subaru Crosstrek here or the largest third row SUV Subaru Ascent. These have the same exact ground clearance despite how large of a difference the bodies are. And if you go with something like the Subaru Crosstrek Wilderness, the Outback Wilderness, or the Forester Wilderness, you get even more ground clearance, usually from anywhere from a half an inch to almost a full inch. So not only will you feel confident knowing that you'll have the ground clearance to go off the beaten path, but if you do get a flat tire while you are out in a remote area, know that all Subaru SUVs have a spare wheel and some of them even have a full size spare like the Outback Wilderness or the Forester Wilderness. And all of them have excellent cargo capacity. Whether you go with the smaller Subaru Impreza, the Crosstrek, the Forester, the Outback, or even our largest Subaru SUV, the Ascent. They all have seats that fold down completely flat, making it easy to store things. You even have versatility up top with the advantage of being able to put kayaks, bikes, or even a rooftop tent on top of your car if it has the roof rails. The last reason to buy a Subaru has to do with price. There are some benefits there. I'm gonna to get to that, but before I wanna share with you quickly the fourth reason why you buy a Subaru. And that is because Subaru is not just a car company they are committed to doing good and doing better for local communities, for national communities, and they do that in the form of donations and charities and partner up with Subaru retailers to benefit all. As an example, Subaru and its retailers have donated to charities like ASPCA, where they have supported over 116,000 pets. They donate to things like Meals on Wheels, where they have funded over 4.3 million meals for those in need. They've also contributed to charities like Make-A-Wish Foundation, where they have granted over 3,300 wishes. And lastly, Subaru is the largest corporate donor of the National Parks Foundation, where they have supported over 400 national parks. The North American Subaru Manufacturing Facility in Lafayette, Indiana, has been a zero landfill waste site for over 10 years, and they were the first automaker to do it. Not only that, but they are the only US automaker to have a wildlife habitat behind their manufacturing facility that has been designated by the National Wildlife Federation. So all of those details are very impressive. So you may like Subaru for other reasons, but even if you don't, you can't deny that that would make you feel good knowing that the company that you decide to do business with does things like that to do better for the world and for us. The final reason to buy a Subaru has to do with the purchase price. So the average new car price, according to Cox Automotive, is hovering just above $48,000 in February 2024. By the way, you can look at this data regularly at caredge.com. Zach and Ray, if you haven't heard of them, they make a ton of valuable videos about the car market. So definitely check them out if you haven't done so already. But anyways, the average is hovering above $48,000. I looked at all of our inventory on the ground right now, as well as inventory that is on the way. And the average new car MSRP on a Subaru this is counting the lowest trim level all the way up to the highest touring trim level is $36,000. Now, if you take out some of those higher trim level models, it hovers well below that. For example, this white Crosstrek Premium that we saw at the beginning of the video, by the way, has sold since we started making this video, has an MSRP of just above $31,000. We've actually sold quite a few cars today, and that is because we have been discounting them below MSRP. 
So you want to know specifically, we took $300 off on that white Crosstrek Premium, depending on how many of that particular model that you're interested in is on your local dealership's lot is going to dictate what kind of negotiation, what kind of price you can get off of MSRP. But the good news is, yes, now there's possibilities for below MSRP and sometimes substantially less than MSRP. Six to 12 months ago, getting a car below MSRP was next to impossible. If you wanna know why this has changed, click on the YouTube card above to the right. I made a full video talking about this in more detail, but the simple answer comes down to supply and demand. Interest rates went up, demand dropped, supply caught up with demand, and so now you have options to choose from on dealer lots and therefore gives you some leverage when it comes to purchasing your new vehicle. KBB also recognized Subarus for having among the highest resale value. And that I think comes down to these five things that I've mentioned to you guys today. This is what makes Subaru such a great car and such a great brand. Overall, I think Subaru offers the best car at the best value that you can get right now today in 2024. That's why I drive one myself. That's why I'm happy to promote them as a brand and as an auto maker. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found some value in it. Maybe learn something new along the way. If you did, please remember to click the like button. That helps me out tremendously. If you have any questions, leave those down below. And as always, I hope you have a great day. I will see you in the next one.